Welcome back to my channel everyone. I have got a really exciting haul for you. I've not done a Primark haul in so long and we've got a little bit of Zara in there too. I went shopping with my mum on the weekend to Cardiff and I wasn't necessarily planning on buying anything in particular. I knew I was on the hunt for a pair of jeans and there was something else but I ended up picking up some really cute bits and I haven't actually tried it all on properly so I thought I would do that with you guys today. I also don't think I've filmed in my wardrobe room before like this. I haven't done like a kind of stand up try on as we go video in a little while. I always ask this but like let me know if you prefer this style of video than me kind of sitting down and putting the try on clips on the side like I guess being able to talk through it while I have it on it does just sometimes make the video a little bit longer so if you like the chatty videos then obviously this one's for you. Before we get stuck in if you're not already subscribed to my channel please do it would mean the absolute world to me it takes a second it's free and if you do enjoy this haul give the video a big like and share it with your friends leave a comment tell me what your favourite pieces once we get into it let's get started these two pairs of jeans are from primark and i'm so surprised that they actually fit me really really well i've been on the hunt for some new straight leg jeans for probably months now i've ordered so many pairs online i did a tiktok where i tried on loads of pairs from asos and i just didn't like any of them none of them fit me right the sizes were like so up and down i'm actually really really impressed by these two pairs of jeans i got them in two different sizes and they're slightly different washes as well obviously this one's quite a light wash this one's more like a mid wash but they're still the same pair of jeans they're the straight leg high rise they're both 16 pounds i got one in a 10 one and a 12. I'm surprised I even got the 10 on. Usually in Primark they wouldn't even come over my hips so they've done something right in this style of jean. And I'd also picked up a few bits from Rita Ora's latest collection with Primark and um, one of the things was this top but in two different colours. I saw the brown one first, really really liked it and then I saw the white and thought that's more of a classic, I think it'll go with more things and it's really cute and summery. So this is what the little top looks like. And then obviously in brown, I got these both in a small, I believe, and they were £14 each. So kind of pricey for a little top, but it's Rita Ora's collection, so it's probably going to be a little bit more. I didn't really think too much about if I would like the top or not, because I'm actually not too sure. I thought it would be a really, really lovely piece. I'm doing this because I'm not sure if it's slightly see-through on my nipples, so... I do apologise. I thought I would really, really like it because it's so cute and like frilly, but it is kind of sheer in the white. And the detail's really pretty. I like that it ties up on the shoulders, but yeah, I don't actually know if this suits me that much. The jeans, these are the light wash jeans in the size 12. And honestly, these fit me perfectly with that bit of room in them. So they're not stupidly baggy, but they've got that little bit of movement and room if I was bloated at all I'm not going to be super uncomfortable. These are what the jeans look like on. I think they fit really really nicely anyway. They're not too cramped. I've got room around my hips and my thighs which is kind of the most important thing is like it's not gapy on the waist and it's not super tight and yeah it's a really nice kind of straight leg jean so they're not super wide and really casual. I feel like I could definitely dress these up. The brown isn't see-through but I actually think I'm still feeling the same about the style of it. I just don't think it's my kind of style which is such a shame. I thought that I would really really like it and feel really cute and girly with it on but I don't know. I don't think I like it. I mean in the grand scheme of things they were £14 each which for a really small little top I don't know whether I don't know I think it just seems a bit expensive for Primark's prices these are the mid wash jeans and um, I was just so surprised that I could get these on in a 10 because in Primark like I am not a 10 usually I am more of a 12 on the bottom anyway but they still fit really nicely these ones are more snug these like fit if you know what I mean so they're a little bit tight in terms of movement and there's not that much give in them but they're still a really nice fit in pair of jeans maybe i'll take these ones back maybe i'll exchange them but i really like the light wash ones anyway so they're the straight leg high rise and they seem to fit really well this is the next piece which is a little 
kind of milkmaid style mini dress again from Rita Ora's newest collection and I'm unsure on this as well I picked this up in a small which is typically my size because I think a small is a 10 to 12 but it feels quite tight and restricting here I kind of wish this was just a little bit looser and stretchier so I'm wondering whether a medium would fit better but it fits me nicely everywhere else if I put you down a bit you can see the dress a little bit better here it's a really pretty style and i really like the way that this is designed to dip down and how it sits kind of just above my hips i think it's really flattering i just think this top bit here could be a bit you know i don't know let me know what you think whether you think this fits really nicely or could i do with maybe just a little bit more room at the top i feel like this doesn't sit under my boobs quite as nicely as I would like it to. I do really like the dress because I don't own like a little white dress like this in my wardrobe. This was £20 from Rita Ora's collection. Next up that I want to show you, so I've put those um, first jeans back on, is this little ribbed vest top. Now Primark have started to do these vest tops but they've got built in like padding and bras there's nothing worse than obviously buying white tops they're all pretty much see-through i've been having that problem lately trying to find some nice um scoop neck vests they didn't have these they had obviously this race style top which i still quite like and i think it was only like six or eight pounds maybe but without yeah without flashing you basically they've got this underneath part and it's got the kind of bra cut padding things in there i'm pretty sure it's removable if you wanted to but obviously the whole point of it is you don't need to wear a bra with this with obviously strap showing it's not see-through um so it's perfect for me who never wears a bra and it's literally just yeah a plain white vest top but you're definitely covered you've got no worries of your nipples showing and poking through okay this was eight pounds it was a little bit more i feel like it's a really good staple at all seasons i feel like you could just layer this up in different seasons but obviously spring and summer it's a really really good basic to style your outfit around and then the last two tops that i got from primark one is just a super basic kind of oversized white kind of cream oh my god i'm actually gonna punch this kid myself I don't know how, pe how people have patience with um, with the children. But anyway, yeah, so this is literally like a like off-white kind of ivory colour, basic, plain, oversized top. But it's in like a nicer, softer material, a bit thicker. It's from the Primark edit is what's on the label. And so is this top. They're kind of similar material. So this top was £12 and I got it in a size medium. And then I saw this one and initially I was looking for stuff for my mum because I was like, oh, maybe that would look nice with um, a pair of trousers that she had. But the more I looked at it, the more I was like, I don't really have anything like this in my wardrobe that's kind of a plain top, but it's just a bit elevated. So it doesn't look like much, obviously, hanging here. So it's kind of like a, a short sleeved um, with like ruched shoulders, but then it's like a loose ruched, like full length top. And I just thought, with like black leather trousers or jeans this could be worn a few different ways it's just a little bit more elevated than a plain vest or an oversized top or like a sexy little crop top it's kind of just like in between it's like a smart casual piece so i got that in a small and this was 14 pounds as well so i'm going to try these on with the jeans here is the one top bearing in mind i don't have a bra on right now i might wear a bralette or something with it i don't no, it's a little bit creased, but it's a bit tighter fitting around here than I thought because obviously it looked quite loose off the hanger off the body. But I like the ruched detail and it's kind of more like a, I think it's like a capped sleeve, so it's just on the shoulders. And I actually really like this shape of top. I think it's different. I think it's quite flattering. I think it's quite elevated. Obviously, you could tuck it into something if you wanted to but I think definitely with a pair of black leather trousers this would be really really nice and you could definitely wear heels with that to dress it up and then this is exactly what I was hoping for with this top I thought the sleeves weren't going to be long enough because I really like a dropped shoulder that comes down to kind of like your elbows I think it's a really cool off-duty just casual style obviously I don't again have um a bra it's not see-through at all but you can kind of like 
see my nipples poking through even though i'm boiling like why am i it is quite oversized so i got it in a medium obviously it's supposed to be an oversized fit if you don't want it to be this big and you're a similar size to me obviously a small will still be slightly oversized but i really like to if i had a bralette on i like to tuck my top up at the back of them and have it down or sometimes i'll tuck the top up at the front just to give it a little bit more shape i wouldn't tend to tuck it in but literally you could still just tuck one side of it in and i know it's super plain but i don't have a nice quality plain top like this in my wardrobe and i think i was missing it just to like easily throw on an outfit because you can accessorize with a cap jewelry obviously in the winter and stuff like scarves and again this will go with absolutely anything it's a really really nice thick quality top so i don't mind paying 12 pounds for this because this is exactly what i was looking for and then i've got two bits from zara that i thought i would show you this up we've got a really nice blue striped shirt i did wear this the other day hence why it's creased because i just kind of threw it back in the bag but yeah it's kind of like that you're wearing your boyfriend's your husband's work shirt kind of vibe but I could definitely style this quite a few different ways. I like that the stripe on it is really, really subtle and small. It's not like super in your face striped. So I got this, yeah, from Zara in a medium. And then just to show you, I'll pair it with these white linen trousers that I picked up. That was what I was after, was a pair of white linen trousers. I wanted ones with like a drawstring and I did pick up some black ones from Stradivarius, but I think I've put them in the wash because I've worn them already. These ones are slightly smarter, but these are probably one of the pairs that are the least see-through for me every pair of white linen trousers has been so super see-through that they may as well just be beach trousers worn over a bikini like there's no way even with nude underwear that i could go out in public because you blatantly just see these ones are a little bit smarter just because they've got the kind of zip up waist and pockets and they've got belt loops and like the pocket detail at the back but i thought that they could be worn quite casual as well just with some like little sandals and a shirt for example or a little crop top like i don't have to dress these up but they could be dressed up with heels and a nice little top if i wanted to so i picked these up in a medium and i think these were 30 35.99 for these and they are a tiny bit obviously bear in mind i've got a light they are a tiny tiny bit see-through but I think I can get away with these ones. I already feel like just this as an outfit could be really, really elevated on holiday in Ibiza, Mallorca, go to Parma with a little brown bag, some brown sandals. I think it's a really put together smart outfit. And I like the fit of it. So like I said, I got this in a medium. This is what it would look like by itself. I didn't want anything too, too big, but I still like things to be a little bit loose. I don't know, I think it looks a bit nicer than wearing something really fitted. I feel like the medium has a little bit of room in there for me, which I don't mind. The detail at the back, I feel there's a label there that I need to get out. But with the right underwear, I think I just need slightly darker nude ones than what I've got on now. I think I'll be fine, but they're a really nice kind of slight wide leg fit. They're the perfect length. For me maybe a tiny tiny bit long but with some sandals or trainers or whatever or heels i think they'll work really really nicely so these are the best linen pair of trousers that i found on a hunt so far they're not necessarily just like a trendy piece that i'm only gonna wear once or twice i feel like i could re-wear these again and again mainly through summer and spring i think that is everything i picked up apart from a reed diffuser from primark that's downstairs i really hope you enjoyed i did pick up some nice pieces but yeah unfortunately those two tops didn't fit the way i thought they were going to so i'm gonna have to go and return those and i might return the one pair of jeans just because they are a little bit tight but if you're like me you've got a slightly smaller waist but bigger bum hips thighs head your primark and look for the straight leg high rise see if they fit you nicely but yeah thank you so much for watching i really appreciate you guys if you did enjoy make sure you give the video a like and if you're not already subscribed please subscribe it would mean the world to me make sure you follow me over on tiktok and instagram as well because i do post more regularly over there also tiktok i feel like i'm posting a lot of like little daily vlogs and stuff here and there hopefully i'll see you guys in the next one bye